Look who's alone now. It's not me, it's not me. Those three wise men, they've got a semi by the sea. The DOT are touring the UK's length and breadth. Just before their Birmingham show, Mike directed their van into the secret service entrance of the M5 Burger King, where he worked as a boy. Can you believe that guy? Just held door open for him. Straight through it, not even a thank you. Fucking hate cunts. When I used to work here, if there was a cunt that came in, yeah. I'd take his order and go round the back, fix his burger up. Really? Just put loads of mustard in it. Mustard? Would you not like spitting it? Well, that would be out of order. No one deserves that. Yeah, I suppose. You know where I used to work? It's just shut now. Where did you work? It's just shut. JJB. And um, you couldn't really deal with cunts other than, you know, sell them previously tried on boxer shorts. Wow. Mike boasts to Rob about his perfectly seasoned burger, unaware of the new direction Ted has for the band's live show. Inspired by his Bronski Beat merchandise collection and a love of musical theatre, Ted decides that the DOT shows should go camp and go gothic. Like the gay scene for boy bands, Ted is betting that the goth scene could be the next big point of entry for pop bands on the up. Luckily for the fans, Mike sticks it to the man and decides that the DOT staging should go on as planned. He'd rather put a golden gun to his head than accept Ted's vision to spend large amounts of money on this odd job theory. Pardon my punning. But the excitement that Mike, dressed to kill, has been feeling for the new Bond film has been contagious. So excited did they become that they invited everyone from the showdown to come see the film with them. All that's left to do now is sit back relax and enjoy the high-octane thrills. Absolutely Dame Judy Dench. Meanwhile, Rob has finally qualified as a personal fitness instructor. His first client is Ted. Rob is learning quickly, however, that you can motivate someone only as much as they are ready to be motivated. Rob, I've actually put on weight since you started training me. He does look a bit fat. Ted, listen, diet is massive when you try to get in shape. But all you do is eat burgers and suck beer. Any good trainer knows you need protein after exercise. And here's my protein now. What the fuck are you doing? I'm just getting a chip. I can hear you fingering my food. <laughs> 